Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Ninth Legion. Let's play some more of The Witcher 3 Blood and Wine. And uh, where's the door? There's the door. Okay. So, we are going to do some more quests. We're still trying to level up and earn money, which basically means we want to find little side quests. We want to do some Witcher contracts. We want to get paid for killing shit, basically. So, now we need to go find the Ducal, Ducal Camelengo. I have no idea what that word means. Um, to, he has a contract for us, basically. Um, and it's a contract that is our level. So I would very much like to go speak to this person. Um, I want to get money so we can do up our new vineyard estate that we have. I'm, I'm very much in favour of our having a vineyard estate, and I want to make it look like a nice vineyard estate. So, yeah, but it's going to cost a lot of money, like 5,000 coin, which is about half my money. I could spend half my money in one go, but maybe not right this second. Uh, apparently there's some blacksmith stuff around here. Hang on. Keep calm. Uh, Start no brawls. Okay, that guardsman is a little bit zealous, but fine, I can understand that. Ah, is it in here? Aha! Right, you've got some smithing gear. Can I... Is it in here, or is it outside? Where is it? I'm confused. I just want to sharpen more my gear. Oh, this is the dude we got the sword from. He doesn't actually like us. Um, oh, there, okay, there's that. Cool. Enhance my weapons. Where's my... Where can I enhance my armor? Is it behind him? It's hard to see. It's very dark in this room, actually. Maybe it's behind him. Maybe it's over here. Maybe I can still plant. Maybe I can actually get him to repair all my gear. That might be a good idea. We haven't done a, gear, a full oh, set of look. gear repair for a while. Graces my humble forge. That's right. Uh, you apparently don't remember me exhorting a sword Sorry out of you last have. time. Right, all I want to do is repair stuff. So, does anything need repair? And you're not actually a blacksmith, you're actually just a... Damn it! He's got blacksmith Farewell. stuff, but he's not an oh, actual blacksmith. He is late. just a merchant. I can't actually get him to repair all my gear for me. No, oh, that was a mistake. Seriously, where is that bench? Is, is it downstairs? I don't know. Maybe I don't need to worry about it too much. But I just kind of thought it would be nice if I could have all my gear done properly. But now it's taking too much time. Although, there is also another quest over here. Ooh. You're so glad I'm back. Have we met before? Vineyard owner. Hello. What's all this about? Master Richard, what luck to happen upon you. Got work for me? New contract? Of the contract in question, you acquitted yourself beautifully years past on your last sojourn in Beauclair. I was in a bit of a bind at the time, do you remember? Yet I swore a solemn vow to pay you in full one day. Guess it rings a bell. Sadly, you went on your way before I could settle matters with you. So, I took your coin and placed it in an account for safekeeping. Hmm. What kind of account? A savings account at Chanfanelli Bank. You need but walk in and withdraw. The sum must be rather substantial by now. Thanks. Head over there first chance I get. That that is a remarkably honest I person. By that bank. Um Wow, that's actually that's that might be the most honest person we've ever met in this city series of games. So because he couldn't pay me at the time, he actually set up a bank account for me and put my money in it and it's accrued savings. And I was just saying I need money so I can do up my estate. And this is now offering me money. Um, I'm going to go do that first, quite clearly. Uh, where is the bank? Can I find the bank? Oh, it's r actually it's very close to where we need to go anyway. I'm assuming the bank is actually open uh, at yeah, midnight. No, it's not. Damn it! Um, okay. Well, gotta, we've got to kill some time nice until the bank opens. Makes sense. Where's this notice board? Let's have a look on the notice board. There might be some more work for us there as well. Uh, test yourself for the trials of the virtues. Uh, ooh. Okay, pass some kind of test on the Isle of Lacleck Selavi and receive reward. I could do that, sure. Uh, fisticuffs, no, can't be bothered with that. A knight errant, a brother seeks aid. Will swap a knightly vow of chastity for a different vow, something like fasting or protecting the innocent. Ah, uh, and the vow's ending date should fall close to Savavine. Uh,. Wow, I didn't even know you could swap vows. Uh, hang on, wait. He needs to. So, so this 
Dumas. Gervais de Dumas has a vow of chastity, which he wants to swap out, which I didn't know he could do. Um, before the fall close to Seavine. That sounds like he's got himself... I think he's already broken his vow of chastity and he's got himself in a bit of trouble there. Anyway, uh, <laughs> stop putting up a cursed notice. <laughs> stop putting up these accursed notices. All you do is litter the city. Oh, that's fair enough. Uh, Gwent tournament, no. Tawny invites. Uh, no, we've already done the Tawny stuff. Mark might be worth looking into. I mean, if they're going to pay me for it, I'll do anything. Quite honestly. Well, maybe not anything, but you know, we'll see. Um, I think for now, what we're going to do is we're actually going to meditate until the morning. What time do you reckon a bank opens? I reckon 7 a.m. So we shall meditate until 7 a.m. There we go. See, it's a lovely bright morning. There's lots of people. Wow, for 7 a.m. there are a lot of people about. Are you open yet? Damn it! Bank! People are around here. People need to do their banking shit. Why aren't you open? Fine, I shall meditate for another hour. What, what time does a bank actually open? I guess like 9 or 10 o'clock in England, at least. You open yet? Yes, you're open. Fantastic. Right. Uh, you have a large sum of money to give me. Please give me my large sum of money. Welcome to Gianfinelli Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own. And the customer's always right. How might I be of service? Uh, I'd like to withdraw some coin. Oh, I can also change some coin here. That's handy because I do have a lot of coin to change. But first, money. Got an account here. Like to make a withdrawal. Naturally. Your name? Geralt of Rivia. Wait a moment, please, while I find the relevant record. She has a very unexpected accent for this region. Everyone else talks like they're French or you know, kind of Mediterranean. -y. Um, she sounds like she's from Yorkshire. Okay, there's a cat. Really loud cat, that's an uncomfortable noise. I'm afraid I can't help you. Extraordinary circumstances, you see. There's a note in the records. The account holder is dead. That's inaccurate, as you can see. It's some kind of mistake. The note is clearly an error. To reactivate the account, you'll need permit 838. For more information, please go to window number one. Oh god. This is this is bureaucracy. Right. Where is window number I one? I have multiple swords, bombs, and a crossbow. Can you not see that this is possibly not the kind of person you send to you know on a paper trail? God damn it. Not that I'm suggesting I'm gonna rob a bank. Welcome but to Chanfanelli Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own, etc. etc. How can I help you, sir? I need a permit A thirty eight. I'd like to reactivate my account, so I need a copy of permit A38. Wrong window, I fear. What What do you mean, wrong... wait, what? What do you mean, wrong window? I was told I'd get permit A38 here. Please remain calm, sir, or you'll rupture a vein. So just tell me where I get this stupid document. Perhaps upstairs? In records? Or downstairs in the archive? You must ask them, sir. Do just that. What the dickens? I swear we are being we are being given the run around here, and I will not stand for it. I have bombs, people. I will rob a bank if I have to. Okay, I guess uh, let's go left. I don't know who's upstairs. It could be records or archives, but someone's up here, and someone's going to give me that damn bit of paper. Who? Oh, hello. Oh no, you're not the person I need. Excuse Sorry, me. Gotta get through. Yeah. Hold there. What is this? Back off the queue, sir. No time. Welcome to Chanfanelli Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own, and the customer is always right. How might I help you? I have a feeling we are going to be hearing that opening sentence a lot during this. This where I get permit A thirty eight? Naturally. Just hand me your form 202, please. <sighs> Which form? Form 202. All right. Where do I get that document? Allow me to explain. Permit A38 can only be issued upon presentation of Form 202. 
as stated specifically in Ordinance N60. Please, go to window number one. <sighs> Just came from there. Never mind. Be back shortly with Form 202. They, they have a lot of forms. Uh, oh, hang on. Ooh. Ooh. Am I going to be in trouble for jumping the queue? Hello. You Sorry. Cut in front of me, sir. But I was very quick. I mean, I could say been here all along, but that's kind of blatantly a lie. Let's see what he's going to do about it. Mm, well, couldn't really give a crap. You boar, you churl! I will not stand for this! Just you wait, I'll teach you some menace! Go on, hit me. I am carrying a lot of swords right now. Oh, gentlemen, if you wish to raise a ruckus, do it outside. Outside, now! I've got to go get Form 202! Do I really have to go beat this guy up? <sighs> this is what you get for jumping in the queue, you know? As an Englishman, I understand queues very well. I know what I did was wrong. There's no point in lying about it. Now I've got to play fisticuffs with this dude. Fine. I am kind of the bad guy in this situation. I kind of feel like I shouldn't beat the crap out of him. Ow, this guy actually hits pretty hard. I shall teach you the meaning of decent. No, you're not going to teach me the decent thing of anything. No, we already did that. Look, I'm, I'm, I'm terribly sorry. You cut the line, sir. I know. I'm sorry. I'm in a rush. They've got lots of money for me, and I need that money. I'll give you some money afterwards. Uh, ooh. Oh, she's not there. Hang on. Wait, is there a different... Oh, am I just going to... What? Where's the lady gone? Damn it. Come on. Where the hell she go? Air bomb aid. To follow the scent could be the lead I need. Oh, now I've got to actually like stalk a woman. Oh, she's having a natter in there. All okay. Oh, hello. What's that? Uh, ooh. Sure. What did I just pick up? Uh. Oh, okay. It's just a. It's an advertisement for the bank I'm in. The bank that won't give me my money. Hello, Mr. Guardsman. Don't mind me. I can't go through there because it's locked. Can I help you? Hello. <clears throat> it's me again. So you see, she claims puffed sleeves will be in fashion next season. Excuse me. Got something I gotta huh? take care of at window you one. cannot be serious. I too find it hard to believe. F Excuse me. Can you not see what it says there? No, Do I can't read. Break? Celine, darling, sign this for me, will you? Oh, there you are. Listen, there's something we are on I... break. Ah, you try to be polite, it just never gets through. I love this. We are Geralt, the Master Witcher. Got no choice, and we I are guess. being completely Until stimmied by brain. bank clerks. We have nothing we have no choice but to sit down and wait. Suddenly... Can't actually rob the bank, so <sighs> my word. I wasn't expecting this. Maybe that cat will come back and I can play with cat. You must wait. They have the break now. So, what do you hope to get here, my friend? Permit A38. Though, guess I need Form 202 as well now. Form 202? Easy peasy. A certificate P. Now, that is a challenge. No one's even mentioned Certificate P yet. What the hell, Certificate P? As we are both forced to wait, fancy a round of Gwent. <sighs> no, I can't play Gwent. I spend enough hours on this game without playing Gwent. If I play Gwent, I'll never play anything else. 
I know it's going to be a dark pit that will consume my life. So we are going to avoid that option. See, you know this place pretty well. Must have taken care of a good amount of business. Oh, naturally, my friend. Naturally. Indeed, I've managed to work the system a time or two. You see, such things require finesse. Subtlety. Otherwise, you're stuck. I have seen them try everything. Magic, hypnosis, bribery. Nothing works. Might as well go if nothing works. There's nothing I can do? Be kind. Be pleasant. This and only this. The woman here, she sits at her window 12 hours each day without hearing so much as a good day from anyone. Okay, we can be polite. Geralt's not normally the politest man, but we can be polite. But muster up some flowers. Some perfume. Well, you will resolve your matter lickety-split. Lickety-split, right. you say? Certainly worth a shot. Okay, there's flowers right next to me. Can I take some of those flowers? Good luck. That guy's a little bit creepy. I mean, very friendly and possibly very helpful, but also a little bit creepy. Okay, right. Form 202 and be polite. Welcome to Chanfanelli Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own, etc., etc. How can I help you, sir? Okay, I need Form 202, please. Need Form 202 to get a copy of Permit A38. Do you know that? <laughs> Couldn't have told me. This is not being polite, Gerald. Because of you. This is not Please, what sir. the man said. There's no need to lose your temper. I thought it obvious and thus needed no stating. The form will soon be ready. Name and surname? Geralt of Rivia. Let me find it. Get on, Gimel. Here it is. Geralt of Rivia. Sorry, sir, I cannot issue form 202. Excuse me? The applicant in question has been declared dead. Officially. Now, do tell me, sir, how am I to enter that into the ledger? Hmm, okay, do we just straight up give her flowers, or do we actually try and, like, seduce her here? Well, maybe not seduce her, but flatter her a bit. Tell you the truth, I'm really just here to see you. Hmm. It's a bit on the nose, but then just suddenly giving her flowers seems a bit out of the blue as well. I don't know. Let's go over the flowers first. Got you some flowers, just to thank you for helping me with my file. Oh, but I... I shouldn't. For me? Really? Match the color of your eyes. Oh, fine. You, sir, are quite the charmer. Ah, please, wait a moment. I shall fetch Master Cinfanelli. Perhaps he'll arrange something that excludes the paperwork. That went a lot better than I expected. You tell him then he disturbed, but no, always some bugger who can't stand to wait. Plow me, who's this? Hearty greetings, Master Geralt. You haven't paid us a visit in eons. Been a bit busy, but I'm back now and I need your help with something. Of course. Now do tell, how can I help you? Well, apparently I'm dead. Got a problem with my account. Wanted to withdraw some coins, see, but... No problem there, we'll get you paid up in a jiffy. I'm just gonna need to settle yon tiny wee trifle. Heard that already. Permit A38, among others. Oh, my hands are tied without them, Geralt. But I see you're a quick learner in the ways of banking. You'll get them in a heartbeat. Hmm. No, what happened to my coin? They are they do seem to be giving me the runaround, don't they? Chanfinelli, no more excuses. Pay out my coin, now. Come on, Master Witcher, for why the IR? There's no need. We'll have it all for you. You just need to see the necessary documents. Got a document right here means a hell of a lot more than any of your forms or permits. Have a look. 
Oh, yeah, I forgot we had that. Her enlightened highness, she's hired you. Mm-hmm. And as her personal emissary, I demand access to my account, right now. Uh, uh, aye, Master Witcher. This way. Hmm. He sounds very nervous about showing well, me my account. The trade these days, Master Witcher? Can't complain. Good for you, because in our neck of the woods, things are dark, dark shite. Wine sales are stuck in the muck and sinking deeper. It's the fucking wretched names, I tell you. Folk out with the duchy have me any notion how to say coat de blessure yes. ah, and all that. Yes, it twists what their tongues in bloody knots. Makes them ashamed to ask for it. It's fair, I can't pronounce most Done. of those words. Deposit box 256. Last gen on the right. Uh, last one on the right. Okay. And in here. And what have we got? There would actually better be a lot of money in this, because otherwise I'm going to be very upset. Excuse me? What the hell's this, Chenfinelli? Box is empty. Well, uh, coins got to circulate. So when we learned you were dead, Master, we, uh, circulated yours. Purchased stocks, bonds, invested in a few vineyards. Before we knew it, there was he hall left in the box. Really ought to call it what it is. You robbed me, plain and simple. Nay, Master Witcher, never! I wouldn't dare! Oh, you'd dare. And now you'll answer for it. Open the gate. Master Witcher, I'll pay it all back, every red copper! I swear it on my nana's beard! Hmm. I mean, he's a bank manager. He must have access to some coin. I don't want to have to fight his guards if I don't have to. We could give him some time, see what happens. I mean, if he hasn't got it for us in a week, then we can rip the coin out of his throat if I have to. I think that works. Got a week, not one day more. You shan't regret this, I swear. I'll rustle it up. Have it ready for you in seven days. If not, I'll come find you. See you then. Okay, that was not what I was expecting. I guess I shouldn't have just thought we could walk in and get a whole bunch of money for free. It seems old the game would do that to us, but um... That was a lot of paperwork. I wasn't expecting that. So there we go. That was the banking paperwork episode. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm going to take a break right about now. So do feel free to leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed this episode of banking paperwork. Um, next episode, we will go talk to uh, the, the other dude who we're going to talk to. Who was the other dude we were going to talk to? There was... Uh, do, do, do. The Ducal Camelagio. 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 We're going to go talk to that guy and actually find some paying work. Um, and then in a week, we're going to come back and beat the crap out of that dwarf until he gives us some money. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and hopefully I'll see you all later. Bye.